Was I love at first sight? Well, here's the thing. He's cute. Yeah, she fell in love with the jawline. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. What's up? Hey, I'm Tucker. Scout. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Very special video we got for you lined up today. First of all, what's up boys and girls, Tucker Dawson. It's another exciting day to be alive. Second of all, this is my beautiful girlfriend, Scout. And this is kind of like the first official video that I think we've done together, I think. I don't know, but it's kind of exciting either way. So what we've got here is just 20-ish burning questions with Tucker and Scout. Who should pick first? Let's do... Shing Shang Shong. Shing Shang Shong. <laughs> so, wait, is, that, is that German or is that Japanese? Scout's German for those of you who didn't know. Yeah, so we call it Shing Shang Shong. They don't have any meaning in German. Shing Shang Shong, these words, so... But I don't know if it's any other language either. Okay, so wait, is it... Is it... Fall asleep? <laughs> yeah, Shing Shang Shong. What does well, that mean? I we never established the ground rules, so I don't know what I that start. really means. Okay, so you pick the first question. It's exciting. I feel like I should close my eyes. What was on your mind the last time we had sex? The last thing that was on my mind the last time we had sex was, uh... <sighs> because the last time we had sex was 4 a.m. and you just woke me up and you just attacked me. Oh, yeah. So I was like, mm, what? Okay. I know you like that. First That's question, really that was good. good. Okay, what is your idea of a perfect date? It's gonna be something to do with Wait, chocolate. Wait, so you have to answer, right? I can. I mean, there's not really rules in the streets. Oh, okay. I think my idea of a perfect date is anything to do with um, being outside. I think I always overthink it and think dates have to be something to do with like going out and spending money. But I think at the end of the day, like the best date is just spending time together outside. So uh, what's your idea of a perfect date then? Same thing? Yeah, maybe now it would be probably like a picnic somewhere. Uh, somewhere where you can have a great conversation. Yeah, like this under the, these yeah. trees here. This is yeah. nice. This is nice. Is this a date? I was just ah, going to ask okay. that. <laughs> that <was> so, <laughs> so stupid. What is the most embarrassing thing you've seen me do? Like off the top of my head is the Halloween thing. <laughs> no, no, you can't <laughs> well, say that. Why can't I say it? <laughs> we were at uh, one of these haunted houses, right, in Seattle. It was night, of course, and while we were waiting in line, there's like people in masks and costumes walking around and scaring you out of nowhere. And they all came to me. Well, because Scout I... looks so innocent. They're like she's like so scarable. Look at her. Ah! <laughs> 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 So anyways, there's these people walking around and scaring her, and there was just like this African-American lady who just walked by. She was like, she, she was short, scout, like saw her out of the corner of her eye, and she was like, ah! And she got super scared, because she it was just some random lady. So like, the lady looked at scout, and she's like, uh, excuse me? <laughs> I don't know if it's necessarily embarrassing, but it's just like, that's the first thing that comes to my mind. Tucker does embarrassing things all the time. I just started at this new job. It's like the second week that I was working there. Tucker comes in completely dressed up. He had a wig on, a fake mustache, and this like, random accent. Yeah. Just, I made a reservation at a restaurant under the name Sambrugio and just, I went in and pretended like I didn't know her. And it was so obvious because the wig was like so fake. Okay, this video is going to be too long if we go all the way into these things. Oh, this is interesting because I don't really know where we'd base this off of. Where would you rate yourself as a kisser, like I'm a, a good kisser, on a scale of 1 to 10? Saying that we've been dating for 6 years and you're still with me. I can't be that bad of a kisser. But obviously, maybe I'm not basing my being with you on how good of a kisser you are. <laughs> Just rate yourself, Scout. Rate yourself. <laughs> like a eight? An eight? Okay. Name two celebrities you would want to have sex with if we weren't together. Ryan Gosling, Zac Efron, Channing Tatum. Scout, you can't just keep throwing them out. <laughs> the, the, the question was two. Wait, if I... Just ask the question, shouldn't I be asking you? Why did I just answer? Why and did why you just answer? So I have to answer that last one? No. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, what's your favorite swear word? Um, and I'll say mine too because I didn't get to say my answer on the last one like I was supposed to. I would say fuck. I, yeah, I was gonna say fuck too, so there we go. Nice. Killed it. What is the best thing I have ever done for you? Oh, I like this question. This is easy. It's super easy. What is it? It's also the moment I knew I loved you, actually, for sure. And oh. I, I'll like, I'll always remember this. Not my dog, but it's like my, the first family dog I ever had, Fisher. He died, and no one has ever done anything like this for me in my entire life, but Scout made this poster, and she just gave it to me one day. She somehow got pictures of Fisher and like printed these photos with my dog that had just passed away and me, and then like wrote like a bunch of memories and drew Fisher, and then like did a little text bubble that said, I love you, Tucker, and stuff like that. And that was the best thing I think anyone's ever done for me, at least in that moment, like it was so, it meant so much, so. Oh. <laughs>
That's yeah, and that's where I was like, damn, this girl's a keeper. If you had one day left on Earth to live, what would you do? Oh fuck. Honestly, I would probably go somewhere into the mountains and just be in nature. Just Anywhere in particular, or just not LA. No, like somewhere like in the mountains. Yosemite. Do I really want to spend like eight hours in the car? car? Yeah. Well, let's just assume you but can teleport. Let's just time, assume you can teleport. Oh, I could teleport. Okay, maybe not. Let's not get into wow. this question. All right. Teleport so she's gonna go die in the mountains. Thing. That's it. Woo! Next question. <laughs> Yep. Do you think we will always be together? Yeah. Why? Why do you think that? Because I love you more than anything in the world. <laughs> okay, look at we're burning through these burning questions. Here we go. What is your partner's biggest fear? So we can answer for each other here. Yeah, mine's spiders. easy. Spiders. Fuck spiders. <laughs> ah! <laughs> she gets scared. <laughs> this is easy and it's kind of sad. Your biggest fear is being alone. <laughs> <laughs> is, am I wrong? No. Yeah, okay. Nice. <laughs> That's sad. If a genie granted you three wishes right now, what would you wish for? Go. Why do you need three wishes when the world is at your fingertips, right? Like, if you have a wish, you can you can make whatever you want happen. Um, you just have to work hard enough for it. So, you know what? I don't even need That's three wishes. That's not even Oh, no. I can just, I'll just try to make it happen myself. So the genie comes up and you're just like... Yeah, I'll just be like, fuck off, mate. No. Wait, is it Will Smith, though? Is the genie Will Smith? Well, of course. I'll be like, yo, what up, man? Like, you want to work together? Okay, Could so if the genie is Will Smith, I would love to just be in Will Smith's life. So there you go. That's my answer. <laughs> what is your favorite thing about us? I don't know. The connection that we have. Yeah. Us. Is that a good answer? What is my favorite color? I think it's maroon. But I don't know, that's probably changed. It's changed, right? Yeah. Uh, okay. Because maroon's kind of just a weird color, to be honest. I always thought that was kind of weird. What? Yeah, just like maroon. Maroon is a nice uh, color. That's turquoise. Oh, well that was the other one that was like maroon and turquoise. Yeah. It's always, okay. Who is smarter, me or you? And we're going to answer when I count down from three. Three, two, one, you. Me. <laughs> Yeah, that was easy. I do have to say, it's like a different level of smart. Yeah, it's like much smarter than me. <laughs> if I went into a coma, how long would you wait for me? What the fuck? Oh, it better be forever. If you went into a coma, I would be there for you f for until yeah. you died. Yeah. But like, what are we talking about? Like sexually? I don't... <laughs> I, I don't know. What if it yeah, ends up being... What, what the fuck? Is it? I don't know. What's your favorite quality about me? My neck. My back, my pussy, and my crack. Definitely your personality and how it doesn't matter where or like what is going on. He's always the happiest and always wants to make you laugh. Like He's that. a happy boy. Pick it from the hat. Favorite sweet treats. Favorite sweet <laughs> treats. Nintzfai, it's a little candy from Germany. I don't know if it's German or not, but it's good. I yeah, don't really like sweets. So that was kind of a question more for you when I wrote it down. Yeah. Her favorite sweets are literally just give her candy, cake, or anything. There's she another knows. question in here that's gonna go along with that really nicely. My turn. Is it about my teeth? I don't know. What do you remember about our first kiss? Uh, okay. We were under a tree. Nice. He was actually waiting in the alley. Yep. And we went to this tree and we just laid down and we just kissed. And we humped. Nope. What the? <laughs> what are the odds that I pick those two? I mean, I guess one and two. How many cavities have I had? I forget if it's. Just it, get to the point. It's 19, Just I think. Is that right? It. 19? <clears throat> well, I had 19 last year. Can you believe that? 19 cavities. Have you ever heard of anyone having 19 I didn't get cavities? To the, didn't she get... has white teeth, too. It doesn't even make sense. She just I have has. Great teeth. She, no, you don't have great teeth. I have you have great 19 teeth. cavities. Unbelievable. I didn't go to the dentist for two years. So, kids, go to the dentist. It's not even about make that. Just floss and brush no. your teeth. And don't eat candy for every single Tucker. meal. Next question. Was I love at first sight? Well, here's the thing. I saw you in the hallways, and I was definitely like, oh, he's cute. Yeah, she fell in love with the jawline. <laughs> <laughs> um, I felt bad. <laughs> ah! <laughs> it's just a stick. <laughs> As an exchange student, so like in my mind, I was like, like she's just the... here to be promiscuous, you know, just like. <laughs> no. Her locker was two lockers down from Trace Tinkles. Can you believe that? That's crazy. Trace, if you're watching this, you could have had a chance at Scout. Well, I think that that Anyways, answers that question. No, let me talk. But then, as soon as we hung out, I was in love with you like right away. Okay. Next question. Who said I love you first? 
okay, I just want to say this. I know this moment by heart. Well, so obviously the answer to that question is me. I said I love you first. <laughs> we were on a date or something. We did something. Okay, she Maybe remembers it movies. really well. He dropped me off. I went out of the car. I went over to his side, gave him a kiss. You kissed me and then you started to like turn away, like you were gonna like walk away. And yeah. then I said it because I like, I really wanted to say yeah. it. And I was like so scared to say it. I knew in the back of my head, I was like, I have to say it, I have to say it. And you started to walk away and I was like, ah, I love you. Yeah. So. Okay, well, uh, we're out of questions. There's no, there's no more burning questions. Oh no. So that was, uh, Let's just give ourselves a round of applause here. That was good. I learned, uh, I learned that I love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, that was a fun video. Wouldn't you say it was fun? Yeah, it was fun. So if you like this video, you got to give it a thumbs up. Just. I don't know. What were you doing? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. But I want to just like thinking. the video. Subscribe as well. And, uh, you know, thanks for watching. It's been great. And we will, uh, we'll see you next time. Scott, let's walk up to the camera and both put our hands over the camera. Here we go. Can you not take so long? It's definitely not like... Skirt, uh, okay. Uh, peace, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace, 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 peace. Scott, what are you doing? So dumb. <laughs>